But we're gonna keep moving on. Emily brought some more stuff to show us here. Uh, we're gonna keep moving on to the letterpress four and one toolkit. Now this is cool. I, I, I'll admit, gotta admit Emily, I don't know what letter pressing is. Well, I'm not uh, sure what this is, but I'm fascinated by it. And it's four in one, so maybe you can explain what are we getting and what are we gonna be able to do with this kit? All right, so the four in one is for your letter pressing. Okay. It's for your stamping. It's for your stenciling, as well as just the base is magnetic as well. So I'm gonna get into that in a minute, but I do wanna tell you guys what letter pressing is because I feel like it's a fairly new thing to the crafting world. Okay. And it yeah. is <laughs> the art of stamping a metal stamp and it debossing the impression into your card so you've got a nice you can touch it it's got texture it's nice and debossed you want to touch that see. you can yes, feel it right. <laughs> Uh, okay, yeah, right, uh-huh. So you've got a really beautiful image that is imprinted into your card base. And what I really like about that is when I'm doing watercoloring, it does help keep my watercolors inside the lines, I find, because oh, of the deboss. Oh, good tip, right. It'll stay in there because it's just slightly, oh, right. Okay, can you show us kind of what we have here? Let's see, I wanna show you everything that you're getting with this kit here. Here, I have it here on my card. Let me see, you're getting uh, 10 sheets of the card stock, you're getting your letterpress, you're getting that, uh, white rolls removable tape. You're getting a black ink pad down there. You're doing a great job, Emily. Look at you. Look at Emily. She's a pro here. Uh, two of the two-piece stamping plates as well, all in your kit. Remember, it's a four-in-one tool kit. Appreciation price of $99.95. It's an amazing deal for everything you get. Okay, are you going to show us here? Do you want me to switch your sides sure. here? Again, okay. I will show you guys how this works, and then I'll show you what comes in the bundle. Well, okay. Actually, I'll explain it while I'm here. You already did that. All right, take so, a look. No, you this... have to, you know, you have to explain it to me because this is all new to me and I'm taking all a right. look here. So this is the platform here. What I really like is when you close it up, you've got the perfect center as well as your different card size. You've got five by seven, four by six, and your A2 card size, which I know is very popular here in the United States. Mm -hmm. All I'm gonna do is use that removable tape. Again, this will not tear your paper, which is amazing. I've reused this many times before too. Mm -hmm. This is a magnetic base. So all I do is I'm gonna stick my stamp in here. Oh, I can see how it clips down, stays yes. in place. Oh, that's yeah, good. Yeah, so it's nice and sturdy. And then the lines really help you get that straight sentiment because I don't like a wonky sentiment sometimes. It's no wonky <laughs> sentiment, no. says Emily. That's right. <laughs> well, you do. You spend time on something, you look at it, and you go, oh, it's just off a little bit. Okay, here we go. And then this ink pad is the perfect size for this. You're not okay. getting too much in one area. You're really putting the ink where you want it, plus you're not going to get any on your base. Um, a pro tip, if you do mm -hmm. do it inking straight on here, is I like to layer it between with acetate just to keep my base nice and clean. As you can see, okay. there's not a lot of black ink. And then I did just realize I got a little bit, so I'm gonna just wipe that off with my finger again because mm -hmm. it's acetate's nice and easy. And then all I do is sandwich it together. Nice thing about this is I can squeeze this however I want. I don't have to hold it by the handle. Okay. Just hold it however you'd like. Then this is the electric go power in emboss machine. It might be a little loud for a second. Just give me a second. <laughs> oh yes, and we're gonna tell you that. You're able to pick this up as well. This is the go pow power emboss machine. Oh, this just fits perfectly right inside? Oh yes, perfectly. Oh. No shims needed. And there's no shims needed for this platform either because it is raised up. And my tape fell down. But you can see we've got this beautiful uh, flower image here. And then if you wanted to, you could go over it multiple times. That's the nice thing about this platform is the base does not move. So we're not getting any wiggle room. The lid is always gonna stamp in the exact same spot. So you don't have to worry about anything moving on you. And that is how I got this card sample. You can see I did the pink just on the flower area. I went through once and then I actually did go through this four times to get nice and dark, but I've Ran through this four times in my machine. Nothing moved. As you can see, everything is nice and crisp. I can run this through multiple is, times. Look at the detail. Thank you for that for that shot. That close-up shot's amazing. But as you get closer, just what you're saying, the detail on there, right? Those intricate designs. You're getting to see all of that. That's what you're getting in this this letterpress. I think. I think we had like 600 remaining in these. That's it. We only had like 600 letter presses to go around on a day like. Okay. Oh, now we have. Okay. All right. We have. 
500, 500 remaining on a day like today. Get it before it sells out. Everyone <laughs> is tuning in right now. That's when these things go very quickly on a day like today, right? We may talk about this on a regular Tuesday and a few people jump in, but on crafting specific days, these items go very quickly here. So I just want to give you a heads up on that. All right, Emily, I'm going to follow you. Where are we going next? So now I'm just stamping. This is just with a regular acrylic stamp. Again, this is another great platform for that because there's no wiggle room. Everything will re-stamp in the same spot. So I'll show you that here. I'm going to stamp it once. Oh, it didn't go all the way through. No worries. Oh, because it's perfectly in place. Exactly. And I don't have to worry. And now look at that. that. It's perfect. And I could go back over if I wanted it darker. And I'll show you again just how this does not move. I would laugh if that does happen on live TV, though. I feel like that's such a thing that would <laughs> right, happen. Yeah. <laughs> Take a look. I want you to notice you're getting $20 off four flexible payments. Intricate designs that you're getting here. Okay. And nice. then okay. it does come with two metal little plates. And since this is a magnetic platform, the base, okay. you can use it with stenciling. So I have got um, a piece of foil here, and I'm going to stick my little metal plate on top of my paper. Okay. I might need to maneuver it with these holes. That looks good there. You're supposed to use it with a smaller one, but you know what? This works too. <laughs> and this is the pin that so many of you are still picking up right now. If you just tuned in, we talked about this hot foiling pen just a second ago, and most people on the line right now are ordering the foiling pen here as well. So I want to give you a heads up. It's what Emily is using right now. You can go back in the show or you can look at items in this show and grab one while you can. It's just plugged in to your little charging bank here. Oh, look at this foiling. Oh, I love and then that. we've got the letter N. Bam, look at that. Oh, it, it, there it is. Couture Creations Hot Foiling Pin Kit, $39.99 right here. That's what Emily just used on her letterpress right there. That combination of all these items together. Oh, they yeah, work amazing really together. Yeah. <laughs> you need it all. <laughs> yeah, why not? Why not? Grab it. Uh, take a look. And remember, putting all that in your cart, you're only going to pay $5.50 on shipping. That is it. Once you hit $5.50, you can just ignore the shipping cost on your crafting items. Oh, that's beautiful. So these are just some samples that I've done here using the Lisa Horton ink. Uh -huh. uh, her ink pads work beautifully with the letterpress impression plates. So I've done it with the colors, and actually I did this background with the inks as well, and you can create different colors by blending those. And I actually painted with them as well. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, you're going to have to come back and give us a painting tutorial. That is beautiful. <laughs> you're going to have to teach us how to do that. Oh, my God. What is your What, what, what started you in, in, in crafting and creating? Well, I started with, because my parents, they own yeah. a crafting business. And I couldn't keep my fingers off of all the products. Yep. And then I fell in love with presenting to everybody and educating people on these amazing products and how to use them in multiple different ways. Yeah. Because, again, the, this platform could be used in more than one way. I forgot to mention too that the lid does pop off as well. So if you wanted the base with no lid, you can pop her off really easy without breaking it. Oh, okay, I'm gonna give you a heads up. Less than 500 to go around. Less than 500 right now. It is our big crafters appreciation event today. Thank you guys for being here. That's why you see appreciation price right there. We've dropped it under $100. And Emily, what you talk about is uh, about other people and teaching other people and doing tutorials. C community is such a big part of crafting. So maybe an item like this, which is maybe new to you and you've never seen before, and watching us and watching Emily kind of walk through and talk through it, that's part Part of the community, getting something new, but feeling feeling confident that you can do it, right? Oh yeah, oh, my gosh, could you imagine getting this from your mother or for your like from someone? Yeah, and yeah, I would be amazed if I got this from someone. Yeah. I'd be like, you made this? <laughs> I know. It that's... is amazing the detail in this, plus the ability to play around with the ink stamping with it because the platform's not moving. You can stamp multiple times with many different colors. Yes, right. And we were just using that Go Power Emboss. That is coming up in just a minute. I know, I also know from these crafting days, we have very smart shoppers and they love to get ahead of me. They love to go like, well, I'm going to see what's coming up next. I'm going to be one of the first. It's good. You should. You don't have to wait on us. You can jump ahead and go ahead and look what's coming up later on. And what's coming up, we're only going to spend a couple of minutes on it because we only have a few of them. But if you're